So a question that comes up a lot of times, especially in a market like this, when homes are going for over asking, people mm -hmm. are getting a lot of value for their homes. Um, they think maybe I can get a little bit more by selling it myself, right? And not using an agent. Sure. So yeah. um, obviously you've got some experience with it, some numbers to back it up. Mm -hmm. Why doesn't the for sale by owner equation uh, add up? Basically, you would think on paper it would work out well. Like, you know, uh, let's let's not pay the 5% or the 6% to the realtor and let me go ahead and, and do this yourself. But there's a few costs in there that home sellers may not even be aware of, okay? And then after we talk about the costs, if it's okay, I'd like to talk about a few statistics that are pretty staggering and sure. not in the favor of a homeowner. Sure. Okay, so first off, Let's just talk about a $250,000 home. It's close to the median mm -hmm. Rhode Island, uh, you know, price range. A lot of surrounding Massachusetts has this price range as well. Okay, so at that price, you have to pay a buyer's agent. Okay, you're paying what two and a half percent at least, maybe three. But at two and a half percent, John, you're looking at uh, uh, $6,250. All right, so it's two and a half percent right sure. there. Going. Then you need an attorney. You got to drop the deed. You got to do all the paperwork. And when they know you don't have an agent, they slam you because they know you're going to be a lot of work for them. And rightfully so, they can, right? right. 4500 bucks right there. They're going to be doing a lot more hand holding than they yeah. would. Yeah. Absolutely, right? And then if you want to put your house on the market, there's something called entry only, which gets you on the MLS okay. and on all of the different websites. But that could cost you between $250 and $1,000. Well, there you could have hired a realtor for that price point and you still could have probably done a lot better. You, know, you have some statistics right on uh, mm -hmm. the average uh, price of a home that's sold by an owner versus one that you know they use an agent to sell their home yeah sure actually the average uh, for sale by owner sells 13 percent less than an agent assisted sale there's a lot of factors behind there yep. and uh, one of them is that uh, for sale by owners have a hard time with the pricing sure okay they have a hard time maybe with the negotiating they have a hard time with, uh, there's more to it than just slapping it online on a few websites. You gotta have a real understanding of the real estate market in the area, even right down to the neighborhood, right? I mean, you guys talk about comps all the time. What are the yeah. other houses in the neighborhood going for? What's the real value of it and how much can they get for it? Mm -hmm. The average person doesn't have, I mean, it's not their full-time job. They're not a realtor. They don't know what they can get for that home, so. Yeah, you're right on. And I gotta tell you, I mean, homeowners have access to more data now than ever, which I think is a real good thing, okay? Right. Because you should educate yourself when you're looking to put your home on the market with or without a realtor. And I'm not here to talk you out of doing it. I just wanna give you the other side of things. Now, keep in mind, the owner of For Sale, uh, by owner.com used a realtor to sell his condo that his website couldn't sell. <laughs> Think about that when you're going in, you know, going on that route. Obviously, um, there's some people out there who probably can, you know, can handle it. They've sure. just educated themselves to the point. But for the average uh, person out there who's looking to sell their home, it probably makes sense to call up that realtor. By the way, if I can add this in, yep. you want to Google whoever it is you're interviewing for real estate agents, interview at least three. I even tell my own clients this okay yep. look up reviews look up sales check all of that out before you hire good stuff man thanks for joining hey man thanks for, for right. having me here yeah.